and let's jump off the side of the world because I am not proud of this. <laughs> I'm not blue. I would die, I would die. Hello everyone, welcome to another Wednesday with my backlog. Today we are taking a look at art school, school with a Q, and uh, yeah, I don't know much about it, but I did take a little bit of a look at it, but it basically just seems like, I mean, what it sounds like. You do art. I don't even know if there's like guided art exercises, or if it's just draw whatever the hell you want, or make whatever the hell you want, but we're gonna find out together, so let's go. Let's go. Yes, let's go. Let's go? Froshman, welcome to art school. Okay, maybe it is a, is actually a thing. Okay, greatest art in the world. And a faculty advisor. Oh no, I am actually going back to school now. I don't want to. <laughs> I analyze your work against my vast database and give you constructive feedback. Okay. It sounds technical, but art school is really simple once you get the hang of it. Yep. Uh-huh. Just use your drawing pad. I'm hoping you mean in-game, because I don't have one of those. <laughs> it's here to inspire you. It's loaded with some really beautiful scenery. Okay. I am eager to get started. I think. I mean, I'm bad. I, I mean, shapes I can do. Shapes I can do, so that's good. So it is kind of guided, but also you're drawing. Got what? I was honestly was not expecting this much. Um, why? What? <laughs> what is going on? Oh no! <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> this is kind of adorable. Is that me? Except for the bowl cut. It could almost pass as me. <laughs> okay, so wait, hang on. So I'm gonna use the- oh, I can walk around! What's this thing? Oh! Interesting. Alright, this is- honestly, this is more game out of this game than I was expecting. I thought it was just gonna be like an art pad, but with game elements. Which- well, okay, so fair enough. I suppose that is what it is. But, I mean, I wasn't expecting to be able to walk around, I guess is what I meant by that. It's so- it's so sparkly. I probably should actually draw, shouldn't I? So there's a triangle. Beautiful. I've gotten really, really good at drawing on computers uh, recently since I've had to start um, computering online. And I've had to draw shapes. And uh, yeah, now how do I go back and submit it? It looks like a face. I didn't mean to do that, but um, now it's a face. So, uh, okay. What do I click? That looks not like I, what I want to do. This- no. No. Oh, I was right, it isn't what I want to do. Wait. Okay, the controls are a bit confusing to me because I am not sure what to- no, no, no. Oh, I changed colors. My bad. I'm confused. Do I have to walk back in the art school building? Is that what I need to do? Is that all I need to do? Is there a door here? This- this art pad is in my way. There we go, okay. Let's take a look at your work. Those better count as shapes. See? Oh, I suck even at drawing shapes. Uh, what? <laughs> that amped up really quickly. Draw something you'd like to happen in the next few weeks? Jesus, I don't know. Let's pick up some text. Oh, oh god, okay, it's so wibbly. Can I- can I- can I change the camera sensitivity? Because I feel like it's not that important, but if I am gonna walk around, it's a little faster than I would like it to be. Am I on top of the art school now? Where the hell did it put me? I would like... Hmm. Let's go wander around while I think. Ah! Uh, oh god, it's a bottomless pit! Okay, so I can't... Um, uh, what? I'm I, I didn't know jumping off the building was gonna... Yeah, it needs a little more work. <laughs> I didn't put anything on it. I didn't- I thought it was on top of the art school, not in an endless void. What's this giant thing over here? What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Is it a jungle gym? Because it has eyeballs. That feels weird. Hello? 
Hello? No, I can't. All right. Didn't look like I could do anything with it there. I also can't walk. And now I'm lost because I don't know where the door back to get analyzed is. Over there? Over here. Over- nope. Oh! 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 I see it in the distance! I see it in the distance! I could go around and collect some stuff, but I'm not gonna. Let's see. Let's go. What is that? It looks like a bird. But it's a building, I think. No, I need to head back to the art place itself first before I do anything else, because otherwise I'm probably gonna jump off the side of the world again accidentally, and we don't want that. I'm still trying to think about this right er, writing prompt. Obviously more used to writing prompts. Um, this drawing prompt, that's what that's what I'm looking for. I saw it! Where'd it go? Oh no, I'm lost again. I mean, on the plus side, I can just jump off the side of the world when I want to submit my art, right? What do I want to happen in the next few weeks? <sighs> like, besides eating food, getting some sleep, <laughs> I honestly have no idea. Let's just... I only have two colors and I'm never going to be able to find another one. At least around here, probably. I didn't see anything and there are a lot of like blobby things in my way so and this is another yeah that's another obstacle not a thing to collect so what if i just wrote something <laughs> I, took, I don't know what i'd write either if i don't know what to draw i don't know what to write but i could just put text on it and call it a day i'm gonna draw a roller coaster it's gonna be a terrible roller coaster but since theme parks are now reopening why are you not letting me draw that is something I would like to do sometime in the near future. So let's draw a roller coaster. A really bad, really terrible roller coaster with no depth to it because that is not going to happen. I may be able to sort of draw on paper, but I cannot draw on a computer to save my life. So there's that and then it's going to come straight down. Maybe it goes straight up. There's the station. And then it goes back down around here, and then it loops. Just pretend this is in 3D, okay? And then that is a weird looking hill, but there you go. There's my roller coaster. I need some more supports in there. Some, some supports in here. There we go. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> This is no, no one is ever going to ride this, which is good because they shouldn't because it's severely broken and structur structurally unsound. But I have roller coaster. So let's put a cloud and another cloud and another cloud and another cloud <laughs> just so I oh god. Okay, just so I have some variety in there and let's jump off the side of the world because I am not proud of this. <laughs> Oh no! I didn't jump far enough. <laughs> I still haven't jumped far enough. Come on, I want my art graded. <laughs> I like yeah, Please don't. How is that one better than my shapes? There are 50 assignments. I'm never gonna get through all these. Okay, there's six colors. That's good to know. And 16 brushes. I definitely need to explore a little more. Let's do that this time. Give me a prompt that I- prompt that I actually- What do you see when you catch your reflection in a car window? Oh, you want me to do a self-portrait? Oh god. Okay, sure. Yeah. I mean, I'm not blue, so there- I spy a problem. Ooh, a paint bucket. Still, I'm not blue. I mean, I'm blue, but I'm not blue, you know what I mean? I'm not blue. Baba dee da -ba die. What if I just fill this in? <laughs> there we go. It gives me a background. My car is this color blue, actually. Maybe I should do the dark blue. Okay, so that's my car. That represents my car. Not my car window. Because, wait a minute. Let, what if I actually... No, stop that with the paint block itself. What if I actually drew a car window? So, like... Alright. No. No, no, no. So my car window is like, kind of like that, right? And then let's go all the way to the sides. So maybe I can paint bucket the window itself. And then it's, it's like flat. Hello. It's flat down here, right? That's a car window. Okay. You see it? I see it. And then we, yes, there we go. There's my car. There's my car window. Actually, my car is like, 
Okay, so if I- oh crap. If I do this... Game, please. If I do this... There we go, there's my car. And then we're gonna fill this in. There we go! I made my car, now I just have to do a self-portrait. Um, I guess it's gonna have to be in dark blue, because that's my only option. So here's my face. I apparently have a very round head, um, in my mind. So right now I sort of have bangs, so there's my hair. And then my hair goes like this, and it's all curly, so it's got annoying little curly cues off of it. There we go. And then maybe I should draw my neck. There's my neck. <laughs> and I normally wear t-shirts, so there's a t-shirt. My hair is in my way. There we go. Okay, I'm half not haired, so there we go. There's some more hair. And there's some hair back here, and some hair back here, and some more annoying curlies coming off of it. And, oh god, now I have to draw my face. So my nose is like... Here. No. My mouth is here. There we go. I'm very angry, apparently. And then my nose is here, and it does not look like that, but we're gonna go with it, because it's not gonna get much better, let's be real. My hair looks really weird. I'm gonna just... I don't know if that's better, but it looks less weird. <laughs> okay, there we are. And then I have eyeballs, which are definitely not going to get any better than that. And then pupils, terrifying cat pupils, and some glasses that, wow, those somehow make it more terrifying. There we go, that's my face. <laughs> I mean, it, it could be worse. It could be a worse representation of me. I don't look at myself in my car window very often, so... <laughs> I'm mostly just getting in my car and leaving. Or, you know, whatever. Grade me! Plump. Don't you give my face a bad grade. My face is a C, apparently. You heard it here first, folks. My face is a C. <laughs> uh, draw as much of the universe as I can fit on the page. Most of the universe is a black void. So what if I just paint a black void? There we go. Abstract art. I am going to look for more colors first, though. Before we submit it. What's down here? I haven't been to this part yet. Is there a new paint color? Is there black? Because that would be super helpful. I suppose I could put like little stars in the distance or whatever. I don't see anything to pick up here. Wait, what is this? Grease pencil? Ew! <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna put some itty bitty little stars here if I can. Stars, maybe a galaxy over here. There we go. Got the, um, the middle bit. Or the, the disc bit, and then a, like, one of these cloud of stuff. That looks more like a planet. That's fine. Whatever. It's not. It's either a nebula or a galaxy. It looks, actually, if it's going to be one of the two of those, it's probably a nebula of some sort. Um, there we go. Okay, we're just going to go with that. That's the galaxy. You're welcome. Whee! And now I'm jumping into the galaxy. Unless they meant this is the galaxy, but still, my picture is accurate. <laughs> Hey, aww. I thought I did better at that one. I'll do one more. Maybe we can get an A. Make a drawing for my best friend? Oh no. <laughs> now I'm regretting saying I'll do one more. Where the hell am I? There we go. Oh, I'm back here. What? It, how? What? How? <laughs> I don't know. I can't think of anything. I don't even know. I don't like the qualifier best friend anyway. So there's that. But also... Like, literally the only thing that comes to mind is animals. <laughs> and that could apply to almost anyone. So, I'm just gonna draw a dog and a cat, and you can work it out from there. <laughs> or it's for all of you. It's for all of you. You're welcome. My terrible dog and cat drawing that I'm sure it's gonna be is yours. <laughs> now see, I have to think of a type of dog. So, I'm gonna draw the cat first. Normally I'm okay at drawing cats, but this is on here, <laughs> so we'll see how it goes. Now, do I want the body, or do I want not the body? Do I want just a face? That's a good question. I'm gonna test this out, because I don't know- Oh, it's big and- it's big. That's a big one. Okay. 
So we're probably not going to use that, because that's a problem. Okay, so let's pretend... God, no. I hate it. I'm just going to do faces, because that's going to be hard enough. But still, I'm bad at this. <laughs> I'm very bad at this. So cats have, like, a cat face. That, which, well, you know what? It's fine. I'm not going to worry about it, because it's not going to look good no matter what. So there's a cat nose. There's a- wow. Whoops. No, we're redoing that. There's a cat smiley face. That one's a little longer for some reason. There are the cat whiskers. Some cat whiskers over here. Some cat eyes. There we go! It's a cat. It's recognizable as a cat, alright? It's not the best cat I've ever drawn, but it's recognizable as a cat. Now I have to draw a dog, which I don't know how to do. But I'll, I'll try. We'll make the dog floppy-eared so it's slightly um, easier to tell from the cat. I have to think of it. So there's a dog. Oh god, it looks like a pig now. No, we're getting rid of that. So here's a dog head then. I, wow, what is that? That's not, a, that's not anything. That's, no. There's a dog head. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> there's a, um... Uh, a dog has like a little muzzle, not a muzzle, a nose, and it looks like this. There's dog nose coming out there, and then I need to get rid of this line. Can I get rid of this line? No, I can't get rid of that line. Okay, just, just pretend. Okay, there's a dog jaw, there's a dog nose, there's a dog eyeball, and another dog eyeball. And then let's do a little smiley face and a balloon, because they always put those on birthday cards. There you go. There we go, now it can double as a birthday card, you know, just in case you can keep it and then bring it out on your birthday. Screenshot that! That's for all of you! <laughs> You're welcome. I hope you like it. My terrible dog that looks like it kinda- I don't know what happened with its face, but you know what? Paintbrush! I found something. I wonder if there's one per thing, or if there's like more than one per thing, or not. There's some stuff to collect, and 50 different prompts to do, so there's plenty in here to do. It's probably much better if you're better at art, or like maybe have an actual tablet to draw on. I'm not bad- I'm not good with digital art. I'm not great with, like, actual hands-on art either, but I'm definitely not good with digital art. And it's an A! There you go! My- my friend's picture was the A one, so that's the one you want to keep if you want to keep any of them. You're welcome. You're welcome, everybody. That's for you. Thank you all for joining me for this today. I hope you enjoyed this. Leave a like if you did enjoy this. As always, let me know what you think in the comments below. And whether you want to see more of this, I don't know how- <gasps> We could do a live stream of this one. That would be so much fun. Oh my god. So let me know what you think either way, though, in the comments below. And whether you like this or we'll take a look into it yourself. Like I said, I imagine it's better, number one, if you're an artist, because I definitely am not. And number two, if you have some sort of drawing tab or something that you can you can probably hook it up to or you know play the game on it or whatever i wonder if it's available on tablets i didn't look that up if you enjoyed this and you're not subscribed consider subscribing i do a dive into my backlog every wednesday you can find some of those in the description as well as just going to my general youtube page i also do something or try to do something every day of the week so you can take a look at th that stuff as well and i will see you next time